Yeah, none of that is real. Can you imagine? Ever since Adobe dropped their AI generative fill for Photoshop, no one wants to shut up about it. Yes, it's cool that you can select part of your image and generate an object in it, or select basically nothing and make it extend whatever image you had in the first place. So I thought, okay, how can I use this to actually help my audience, which most of you are live streamers. And one of the hardest things for a live streamer is to build and invest in a proper set. This may not look like much, but it took me years of switching it up all the time for it to look like this. A lot of streamers do not have that privilege because of space and because of money. Anyway, so the two things that came to mind was, hey, can I just generate a new light on my wall? Can I generate a better background? And my second idea was to basically make my camera smaller and generate a bigger, better room. A quick side note, if you heard about AI generating images based on artwork or photos of people who'd never give their permission, this is not the one. This AI does not steal from artists. It is trained on Adobe stock photos. So no, I cannot type generate this image in the style of of insert artists who never give their permission. And I did that experiment while I was live on Twitch, so that's a reminder for you to follow me there. And here's how it went. Say hi to YouTube chat. Do it. Say hi My to YouTube. Internet is dying. That's not what I asked you to say. Hi to YouTube. Unsubscribe. <laughs> Hello YouTube. Let's start by taking a screenshot of my camera. We're gonna go ahead and find that screenshot. Look at that, look at a handsome man. Hopefully he doesn't get frustrated while talking to Twitch chat. Let's say that you have a setup that doesn't look good. You don't have a whole set just like me, right? You don't have a bunch of cool lights and expensive stuff and you want to, well, well to, to stream as if you did. You can use Photoshop. I, I believe you can use Photoshop. We're gonna, we're gonna do it today together, right? I believe you can use Photoshop to create your own background and it would actually match whatever part you decide to show. Of course, we would have to basically create a mask around you. But other than that, so the goal here is, here is to mask enough so that it sees what's going on. So it has kind of an idea. So we create the selection. I'm going to invert it by pressing Control Shift I, generative fill. And I can type exactly what I want, or I can just not type anything. And I believe it should basically figure out, oh, okay, I, you just wanna replace this or whatever. Let's click generate first without typing anything and see what it comes up with. I haven't had good results with it. I haven't been playing around with it too much, but I have not had great results so far with it. Uh, all of the, the advertisement I've seen for it, people were, were doing amazing stuff. <laughs> What is that? Okay, it gives you three options every time. Why do I feel like all three are gonna be weird? Is that some sort of like aquarium? What did it do with my light? Hey, look at that. What the heck? That looks like a set in the background there. Okay. Uh, and this one is just jumbled up stuff. If you had a normally lit room, it probably would work better. Probably not. In the picture, you look old. Thank you so much, Mars Monstrous TV. How old are you again? Not so bad. Let's generate again, chat. To be fair, this is kind of a good brainstorming if you want to create yourself like a 3D background. I would probably use that. Oh, wait, what? Oh, that was so weird. For a second, I thought it actually recreated what's behind me with a 3D printer and stuff. Can you imagine? Okay, it has kind of a weird thing going on. Honestly, if you have uh, something like a DSLR and your background is pretty blurry, that would work. That would totally work. All right, this sucks, chat. Give me a prompt. What do we type? Cyberpunk, I like that idea. Cyberpunk, what is, what the heck? I thought I was getting, re I'm record, chat. <laughs> chat, I'm recording a video. I need your cooperation. We're trying to create, all right. So cyberpunk um, background TV show set. I don't know why I thought, hey, let me record a video and include my chat in it. And surely they will cooperate and come up with creative ideas and, and it, it'll be fun. Oh. Thank you. Thank you, Photoshop. That is exactly what I wanted. Okay, let's uh, let's try something else. <laughs> Clearly, this is not working. Let's actually select the subject. Let's invert the selection. No prompts, just generative fill. Hey, it's respecting the colors. I'm actually kind of impressed with this one. It just came up with that based on me, I guess. This is great for abstract stuff, though, like random like video background and stuff. 
This is pretty good. Let's say gaming room set. At least it's trained on uh, their own stock photo library and not stolen art, which is, you know, always a good thing. Oh, we're actually getting somewhere. Uh, this does not feel this like random. Like I could pull up an image from Google, you know? Okay, let's say, wait, what? Wait, 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 wait. Did it modify my hair? <laughs> <laughs> Why do I have gel? <laughs> it put gel in my hair. <laughs> Gaming room, Twitch streamer setup. We're getting somewhere. New nano leaf just dropped. It's the na nano spider web. Oh my God. Actual good idea. You know, that's my favorite. That's my favorite Twitch streamer setup. Chat, the green void. I'm going to scale this down. I'm going to bring it down because I don't want it generating any part of my body. And then we're just going to select the outside part. And we're not going to type anything for now. What the heck? I don't get it. I feel like I'm doing something wrong because there's no way it's that bad. Oh, oh, wait, chat. I think I know what I did wrong. Uh, the selection. I should select a little bit of my room too. That's why. Okay, <laughs> let's generate without any prompts. It thinks those are Christmas lights. All right, let's see the second option. We're getting somewhere, chat. We're doing it. This is so weird though. I'm sitting in a room that doesn't exist. I'm not gonna lie, this creeps me out a little bit. It even extended my 3D printer. It tried. Extended my PC correctly, actually. Is, did it just put a TV near my entrance? That's decent. That is decent. Imagine you can replace whatever screen that is. You can just put chat in there. Ah, uh, no. Oh, it added a gaming chair out of nowhere. It just added, it turned my 3D printer into another PC. Huh. So for example, I would correct certain things to make it look kind of more realistic. Turn off the background. And this is what we have. So now I can export this as a PNG. Now I can go in OBS Studio. I'm going to click on source, add an image source, and I'm going to pull it up. AI room. Nice. So we have it. It's added here. Camera needed to be smaller. The border is weird, but let's pretend that we don't see the border. There it is, chat. I'm streaming in an AI set. This is an AI room. I can add whatever I want. Okay, let's say that over there, we want Funko Pops right there. A shelf with Funko Pops. Damn, does Photoshop know what that is? Okay, shelf. All right, it doesn't know what a Funko Pop is. That's kind of sick the way it's just adding shelves though. Okay, that. It's like jumble, but that looks realistic. That is scary. <laughs> that I'm freaked out a little bit. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie. I'm kind of freaked out. <laughs> okay, this looks like it works. What's going on? It knows the perspective. A jellyfish? Nature TV show. It created an extra border, but not bad. Kids show. Oh, okay. That's, oh, that's still creepy. What is it? What does this look like MS Paint? Oh. Oh. Oh my God. That was okay. What? Okay. That's impressive though. That is impressive. Oh, wow. Okay. What's the third one? Eh, close. Second one. Really good. A neon sign. I'm having a lot of fun with this. <laughs> oh, this one just wasn't neon. Not bad. We can generate more. VA, voice actor chat, are very American. Welcome, Raiders. Let the games begin. <laughs> we got futuristic vents, chat. I asked for lights. It gave me a vent and an event with lights. I'll take it. What else? Ah, uh, that's kind of weird. Uh, I still like the vents better. What happens if I do this, you know? Recess can lights. Okay. Okay. Oh, this one is kind of out of shape, but that works. But I do want to keep the tabletop a little bit. What do we want on top of the shelf chat? Lava lamp? Oh, fridge. Let's try that. But like this thing just designed a brand new fridge. Pleasantly surprised. Uh, I'm just going to overwrite the one that we already created. Oh, <laughs> uh, I forgot it has, you have to make the selection in pretty much roughly the shape that you want. Otherwise, it's going to try to fill it for some reason. That is straight up like a lava rock. Yes, I think that's pretty cool. Oh, that's pretty cool. Future fit. Oh, that's pretty cool. Chat. What happens when AI becomes so smart it produces its own live stream? It, that's 
already a thing, actually. I'm so excited to see it in OBS. Let's export it. So this is what we had, chat. This is what we generated, right? You can see the borders. You can clearly see the borders. Okay, chat, this is my real room. Yo. You wouldn't know, like you straight up wouldn't know. I don't think you would know. I could have a canvas that's 4K with a 1080p webcam and just make the rest, <laughs> make the rest of the resolution, like make, make the rest of the room. I have a lot of like movement, you know? It's not like I'm really stuck, I can't move because whatever, I can do a lot. I can still do so much. Yeah, none of that is real, can you imagine? <laughs> Close enough. I want my light to be completely visible here. All right visible it shall be oh yeah that's real <laughs> i was like wait my why is my shadow appearing there <laughs> i was like this is too realistic look guys my shadow is appearing on it <laughs> but actually this is real that's why i can get up i can stand in this <laughs> It still works. That's it. I'm going to have to cut most of it, but we did it. We did it, chat. Thank you. Thank you for your participation. 